Hot dogs are a staple for any summer picnic, but today we're going to learn how to make them like you've never done before, Venezuelan style. Back with us today, two of our favorite guys. Are you, are you already hot? Uh, it's four of these weeks. Welcome back, guys. Fourth of July week, honey. We're, of course, we're of hot. Of course, This absolutely. is what we like, finally. It's our birthday week, by the way, too. Oh, happy goodness, birthday. happy birthday. Well, thank you. <laughs> thank you. So, this is something you guys do at home? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, absolutely. This is a great way. Venezuelan hot dogs. Why? A Venezuelan hot dog. Venezuelan hot dogs are so popular because this is hot dog with a bunch of crap on top of it. <laughs> Basically, that's what it is. Okay. Uh, hot dogs are Americana. Well, yeah, well, no, no. We actually stole, stole it. I think they stole it from. We us. did. Really? We did steal it and added more stuff to it. Okay. Well, uh, you I, you really do load them up. Absolutely. Well, this is a good thing. Not only now in a serious matter. This is a great thing to do a party. Like you know how people do taco bars and yes. things like that, which have been done and done and so done. So it's very passe, right? Yeah. Well, now let's do a hot dog bar. Okay. Basically. And just basically you put all your ingredients just like that laying down on a table. Which is great and for kids, by the way. Yeah, it's great for kids. Right. For, for birthday, birthday parties? parties? Yes. Fantastic. Yeah. Let them choose whatever they want and to put in the hot dogs. Don't, they don't have to be hot dogs either. You could have what, oh, brats? Could brats, kielbasa, whatever you want to use. It, it's, you it's can so use easy. vegetarian ones. It if doesn't you don't matter. Like meat, oh, yeah, you're you know? right. They yeah. have those now. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. So you can use it now. But I would like to show you what we normally eat. In what you normally eat. Like what we normally eat, yes. What okay. I would eat. know him. To this. I okay. used to be just a hot, you know, you ketchup eat, and you mustard kind of guy. Style. Right, yeah. no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to, you know, a little bit up. A little, okay, a little, bit, a little bit further we're going to okay. go. So, the first thing we grab in, is our bun. Yes. And we have a little bit of mayonnaise. Mayo. Yeah. Mm, I'm going to add mayonnaise right here in the okay. bottom of the bun, right? That's okay. one thing. Then we're going to add our hot dog right on top. Okay. Just like that. Okay. And now let's start building this baby. Okay. Going to load it like a loaded potato. Absolutely. So here <laughs> I have is cabbage, which I just minced really smallly. All right. And this is going to add a little bit of crunchiness to the hot dog. Wow. Okay. I don't think I could even get that whole thing in my mouth. Well, be you'll be surprised. Okay. And then I have a little bit of minced onions. Okay. We're going to put it like that. And you're going to put a little bit. Now, a lot of people like it with a lot of onions. I like a little yes. bit just, just for, for taste. Here I have chopped eggs. And this is the way they do it in Venezuela. Oh, well, we, actually in Venezuela they put the, fruit, the fried egg right on top of it. Oh, a fried egg. Yeah, but I don't want the runny thing just okay. going around. So I boil them and chop them and put a little bit of extra just like okay. that on top of the hot dog. All right. In here I have bacon. Okay, that I just cooked it and then I minced it a little bit. That's going to go right the on top of that. The great thing about this too is you could do the same exact thing with your burgers. Oh, you're I mean, right. When you go there, they put ham on the burger, they put fried egg on the burger, I mean, you can put avocado on it, you know, or guacamole on it, mix it up so however you, can put you want. There's really no limitations. In here too, right? Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Avocados, whatever you want. Yes. Now, this is a, something that I really, really love to put. <laughs> okay, these are potato chips. You know, this guy's right here right. that I put in a little Ziploc bag and okay. I just mash the hell out okay. of him. So, we make it into a little powder and we put it right on top of the hot dog, just like that. Oh, goodness. That is going to add crunchiness. I'm so hungry. Oh, it's so, hungry. so good. Look, look and how now, it does. It does. It's so in beautiful. here is yes. sour cream. With, I added to the sour cream a little bit of salt, a little bit of garlic powder, and a little bit of black pepper. So we're going to put a little bit of this sauce right on top of that, just like this. Look at this deliciousness. Oh. Oh. <laughs> to that, we're going to add, would you get me the... Are you actually going to put ketchup? Oh, yeah. We're going to put ketchup, too. I told you. It's everything. Uh, just like that. This okay. ketchup is dangerous. There you go. Okay. A little ketchup right there. All and right. then mustard. Mustard's dangerous, And then too. we're going to crown this hot dog with, with Parmesan cheese. Mm. <gasps> Never go wrong oh with enough cheese. Oh, my goodness. And this mm -hmm. is a typical Venezuelan hot dog. Now, I want you to get ready. Grab oh, this baby. Okay. And go, you know, go oh, for oh, it. Oh, oh, oh. Billy, try it. Billy, oh, you do it. Sure, Come make on, me Billy, be Are you able to do that? Okay. Huh? Okay. Ready? There you oh, go. That's a mess, but it's right. delicious, it's right? It's absolutely amazing. Oh, my it's God. A, okay. Isn't that good? <laughs> amazing. It's a great thing for parties. Okay. It's yeah. a great thing for parties. You can play with your kids. Even if it's not a party, you're having like a, a day out when you have your, your, your kids, uh, friends coming to your house. Put this whole setup on your table, put the hot dogs on your table, let them have a good time yeah, with it. Yeah, and then you don't put have to be fussing over anything, you know? No, no fuss. Absolutely. It's Take a it great easy. idea for everybody to do at home. Okay, and what else can we put out there when you say, you know, we were talking earlier about the hot I'm dog I'm talking everything. Bar. So what, you, you put this out well, other and other toppings possible? You can toppings? put any topic that you could possibly imagine. Okay. You want tomatoes, dice the tomatoes. You want bell peppers, dice the bell pepper. Mushrooms, grab mushrooms and dice them really, really small. Put them in a little butter and cook them right now. Put them right there as mm -hmm. well. 
different you types of cheese. Oh, of cheese. smoked Gouda goes so good with hot dogs. That is the good thing about this Venezuelan hot dog. The, you know, the imagination just goes and just flies. And, and all of that brings... will taste good together? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It will always taste good together. Oh, I can guarantee you that. That is amazing. <laughs> and who came up with this idea? That well, one is him. My crazy brain. <laughs> you know, I remember always, you know, have your music on, shake yes. your bamban as you're doing it, right. shake <laughs> your, you know, and have a good time with it. That's what, what it's all about, having a good time with hot dogs. Oh, this is great. And is there any way you can low make this low fat what is it this one with the sour cream can you use the light sour cream you can you? but that's so not fun that's uh, the whole defeats okay. the whole purpose of this right, meal okay <laughs> right, the whole purpose of having a good time with this. Okay, all Absolutely. right, we'll stick with that. Anything else we need to know about these hot dogs? Well, yes, once again, like he was saying, if you don't feel like having hot dog or you feel like having a burger, you can build in the same way I have a burger this size that you need to open your mouth a little bigger <laughs> than this hot dog. Mm -hmm. What you do is you put, for example, and this is, I'm just making this recipe up as we're speaking. You put the meat, you put cheese. You put the meat, you put cheese. You put avocado, you put ham, you put bacon, you put chicken if you want to. Really? You put mushrooms. You put onions. You put, of course, obviously, you have to put your potato chips. Okay. You always have to put you your potato crunch. chips <laughs> you because you crunch. have you want the crunchness in there. Trust me. Okay. You what about the different types of hot dogs that are out there now? You can use any kind, like you Absolutely. said. Absolutely. I mean, like I said, if you're a vegetarian and you don't eat meat, they got the ver vegetarian ones out now. You could do the kielbasa. You could do smoked sausage. The hot. The, what are those hot ones called that everybody likes? I don't eat hot food, yeah. but I'm sure the red hots. Red hots. That's I like exactly the ones it. with the cheese inside. The okay. cheese dogs. Oh, oh those I are really good. Okay. You want to make some more? Let's go. Absolutely. Let's go well, for it. well this is your party. Go I ahead. Don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I go can ahead. Do whatever I want to do. Yes, absolutely. Okay, what is your you know favorite what? thing? I'm gonna go with the. Um, well, I love the potato chips. You like the potato it. chips? Oh, I'm gonna yeah. stick with a little bacon. Okay. There you this go. This is great. Go well, make it better. Thank you so much. At the same time, course, I'm just gonna eat this one. All this, all, every, all these ideas are on our website, so be sure to. <laughs> Neil makes it look so much more elegant when he puts it on. Go to Connecticut style, and we've got so much more coming up. We we're gonna have so much fun. Thanks so much for joining us. There's more Connecticut style coming your way right after this. Happy Make them go. They're good. Mm. Okay. Mm-mm-mm.